Hello, in this A-Frame Web VR tutorial, we're going to look at displaying a video. Displaying a video is very similar process to displaying an image. You use the asset loader, or preferably you use the asset loader to load a video into a video tag, and then you display it in the A-Frame video tag. Or you can directly load it so instead of using the asset manager, but that is not recommended. So let's get down to it. So you need an a assets. I forgot to mention one thing. We've already got a video file in a folder called video called this video that MPEG4. It could be on a different website. That's not a problem. You can download this video if you want to check it out from our GitHub page and the source code will be there as well. So in here you want to put a video tag. video video ID equals video so this is what we'll use to identify this particular video and use it I'm going to say auto play so this will uh, auto play the video loop equals true so just keep playing again and again source equals video forward slash video dot mp4 finally webkit dash plays in line we've got one meta tag right here the webkit plays in line and the meta tag that i'm just about to add is for ios just I would recommend adding it anyway just to help compatibility. So, in here, we're going to put name equals apple dash mobile dash web dash app dash capable. That's all done. Then, now we can actually create our video tag by doing a dash video. SRC equals hash and now the net the ID of our particular video that we loaded into the assets width equals 16 it's best if you keep the ratio the same because otherwise well the image will be squashed or stretched or something that doesn't look very nice and put 9 for the position I'm gonna put 0 one and negative one these are values that are already calculated but realistically you're going to want to calculate your own value for this so yeah we're ready to run it now so if you just save it run it okay here we go i think you know what the video is so yeah that is it for this A frame tutorial. If you have any questions, feel free to post them on our education platform, sonarlearning.co.uk. One thing I forgot to mention was actually, I didn't forget to mention it that you can load the video directly into the tag right here instead of using the asset manager. I'm not going to show you that. The code is available on GitHub if you want to see that. But I recommend you go back to the photo, I mean, the image video the knowledge and the code that you've got from that trying to implement it using the video one to directly load it again like I said you you ideally don't want to do it that way but it'll be a great way of learning and just making sure you know all the different avenues just in case this is a better way to do it in one particular scenario that you require so yeah that's it for a frame if you have already asked I've already asked, I've already told you if you have any questions. If you like the video, please do the thumbs up, hit that subscribe button, leave us a comment. If you didn't like it, we, we welcome criticism as well. So leave that in the comments. I'm definitely not going to regret saying that. And as usual, thank you for watching and I hope you have a great day.